In this video, I'm going to show you how you can use the book and quill in Minecraft. So I'm going to go into my world and I'm going to go to my inventory. And in here, I want to search for book and quill. Now there are a few different options for books, but book and quill specifically is this one that has the feather and if you tap it, it'll say book and quill. And then I'm going to tap an empty box on my hotbar and now it has been added. So the way that book and quill works is that you can write in this book. That's what's special about it. So when I'm ready to write, I'm going to tap it and then tap on write. And you get to have multiple pages in this book and quill, but we're gonna use page one, of course. So in here, we're going to type whatever information we need, we want to share for our build. Once I have finished typing whatever it is that I want to share, I'm going to tap sign. But here's where it gets a little tricky. Once you tap sign, and you tap sign and close, you will no longer be able to edit. That means you cannot change anything that you type. So you want to make sure before you do that, that you have typed everything correctly in here. If you need to make a change, you'll need to destroy this one and then get another book and quill. And before you can sign and close, we have to give it a title. So in this example, I'm going to call mine demo for demonstration. And then once I have my title, I click on sign and close. And if you notice, the quill kind of disappeared and it kind of looks enchanted. So that means that there is something written in my book. So as long as I have it selected, just like that, then I can read it. However, if you want to place it in your world, then you will need to go to your inventory. And here we're going to search for an item called a lectern, which is this item right here. So it kind of looks like a podium or a table that a speaker uses. So I'm going to tap an empty place in my hotbar and now I can tap on the lectern. I'm going to place it wherever I want and then I'm going to tap my book and then I'm going to tap right on top of the lectern. Just like that. And now my book has been placed on my lectern. So if I'm moving around my world and I want to come back to it, I can just tap it and then I'll be able to read it. So how do you plan to use Book and Quill in your Minecraft world? 